we wanted to know whether we could slow or block the aging process and prevent cognitive decline. In mice and in worms, higher levels of clotho can really extend lifespan. And in humans too, there is a genetic variant of clotho, um, meaning that there is a code for clotho in some people that produces higher levels of this protein. And those people tend to live longer and be protected against certain diseases. That was our hypothesis, that, that this lifespan extending factor clotho prevents cognitive decline. And what we found was actually very surprising. Um, our initial hypothesis uh, was incorrect. We found actually that those individuals that carry the genetic code that gives them higher levels of clotho underwent cognitive decline just as their peers would. But the difference was that they started at a higher baseline. Evolution and nature has done a remarkable job in optimizing important functions and cognitive functions such as learning and memory are among the most important ones for many different creatures and so it's always quite striking if you find something that pushes the envelope even further than what evolution has achieved. If clotho levels have not yet been maxed out or optimized, one could imagine uh, that a, drugs that increase the expression of clotho or that uh, simulate a critical activity of the protein uh, could be of benefit and may function as cognition enhancers, something I plan to uh, or would like to take before I write the next grant application mm -hmm. or paper maybe.